These four principles promote the education of the whole child. Bells, bells, bells going off. Exactly what does that mean? Our goal to support and teach these four components through your child's education in the unnamed school district. What exactly is a rebel child? Well, when you Google it, this site comes up first. This is wholechildeducation.org. And it describes the tenets of whole child here. Each student school, each student enters school healthy and learns about and practices a healthy lifestyle. Whatever a healthy lifestyle means, you get to determine exactly what that means. Each student learns in an environment that is physically and emotionally safe for students and adults. Okay, physically safe? Okay, that's kind of self-explanatory. What does emotionally safe exactly mean? Or more new, or by, by whose criterion are you defining emotionally safe? Each student is actively engaged. <laughs> I clicked on it here. Each student is actively engaged in learning. And is connected to the school and broader community. Why do I want my student necessarily connected to the broader community? Why would that be something that the school would be working towards? Um, unless, of course, I mean, if you're talking about on a voluntary capacity, that's one thing. But this is part of the curriculum. Each student has access to personalized learning and is supported by qualified caring adults. Okay, great. I don't have an issue with that. Each student is challenged academically and prepared for success in college. What college? Are you talking about the colleges of today and uh, what's emerging from them with the uh, uh, with all the, uh, the safe spaces and ch basically training our children that if you don't like an opinion that you have a right to shut it down, that you you, you, if your feels are hurt because somebody has an opinion that you don't like, that somehow that means you could shut them down. Are you talking about preparing them for that type of college? Now, they mentioned ASCD. Uh, it goes here and describes launched. The Whole Child Initiative was launched in 2007. And it's an effort to change the conversation about education from a focus on narrowly defined Academic achievement to one that promotes the long-term development and success of children. On on whose authority, on by whose definition are you determining what success is? Because success is wildly different from person to person. This is there is an assumption here that there's some universal understanding of success, and that doesn't exist. Through the initiative. ASCD helps educators, family, community members, and policy makers move from a vision about educating the whole child to sustainable collaborative action. Collaborative action. What the heck? What? Why is that part of the part of this curriculum? Part of this program? Why? Why should your child feel compelled to be part of a collaborative action? This is basically your 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 garden variety collectivism. This is this is what state socialism is built around. This is what state communism is built around. This is what state fascism is built around. The idea that the individual is subverted because they're their 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 primary function is to meet the needs of the community to be part of the community this is not what america was ostensibly found on this is this is not individual liberty kind of stuff this is this is something completely different and exactly who is the the ASCD the ASCD is a global community that's right it's globe it's a global uh, uh, globally focused. This is international. You want to talk about globalism? It's literally here. This is it. When they say connecting to the community, well, to a certain degree, they mean the local community, but but really they mean in the overall to the global community. They're talking about creating, in, in essence, a global citizen. 
ASCD is a global community dedicated to excellence in learning, teaching, and leading, comprising 115,000 members, superintendents, principals, teachers, and advocates from more than 128 countries. The ASCD community also includes 51 affiliate organizations. This is this is basically like the United Nations, whether well, or not directly affiliated with the United Nations, so it's I'm using it in a metaphorical sense. This is like the United Nations has essentially gotten its it the camel's nose. It's the camel's nose under the tent. This is internationalism, globalism being introduced to, in this case, the school district that my daughter goes to. Our diverse nonpartisan membership is our greatest strength projecting a powerful, unified voice to decision makers around the world. Okay, and uh, let's see, the ASCD, the Association for Supervision and Curriculum Development. That's what this is. It's Association for Supervision and Curriculum Development. Curriculum development is the key phrase here. Curriculum development is now going beyond teaching your children the R's, you know, reading, writing, arithmetic. And now it's going into social engineering. It is assuming the role that parents, that family, that friends, that your your actual community around you uh, perform. Now the schools are taking a more proactive uh, role in not just teaching your children reading, writing, arithmetic, but teaching your children how and what to think. They are essentially raising global citizens who think and act a certain way. The association provides expert and innovative solutions in professional development, whatever. Uh, let me just go here to meet the ASCD executive leadership team. Uh, there's, there's Sir Deborah Delis. What do we know about Deborah Delis? Okay. Deborah Delise, where are you? There you are. Deborah Delise is the executive director. Okay. And and where was she just before this? Let me highlight this here. She was nominated as the U.S. Assistant Secretary of Elementary and Secondary Education by President Obama in January 2012, confirmed by the U.S. Senate on April 27, 2012, and served in that position until 2015. And she served under the controversial uh, U.S. Uh, Education Secretary Arne Duncan, Duncan, under whose watch Common Core was aggressively introduced and for which this school district which i won't name is actually fully engaging in as well uh let's see deb here former superintendent of cleveland heights university heights schools confirmed as nation's new assistant uh secretary of education and then she eventually left the education department to take the helm of ASCD. I'm honored to join this respected association, excited to lead the next phase of ASCD's growth. ASCD is a talented roster of professionals dedicated to success for all educators and loyal members and whatever. So there you go. That's the whole child, and that's the organization that's behind it. And really, this only scratches the surface of exactly what the whole child initiative means, what this pamphlet means, this whatever you want to call this, the, this contract means when they're using a word like whole child.